So why do I get such great results with my PRP? Well, the secret is what's in the PRP. The PRP is your blood. So we rely on the platelet-rich plasma, which is full of growth factors and immune cells. If that's the case, then we need to engage those growth factors and immune cells, and therefore we have to have techniques. So one of those is fasting. So before I do a PRP on any individual that has either a knee problem or a neck problem or a back problem, I have patients with radiculopathy and sciatica and post-surgery. What I do is try to bring them in when they're fasting. And then I try to stimulate those stem cells in their body, which we call pluripotent stem cells, and that is utilizing hyperbaric oxygen chambers. So my technique is to bring them in fasting so that they, are, uh, they have much richer PRP from fasted cells, so that their uh, immune cells are mobilized by the hyperbaric oxygen chamber. And then what we do is we spin the blood in such a way to just extract the small amounts of the richest uh, part of the serum for PRP before we do the injections. And so when I do the injections, the other strategy that I use is to combine that PRP with ozone and the combination of those two stimulate regeneration. So that's the difference why I get better results with my PRP. And people who are fasting actually activate growth factors in their body called grenadine. And so it's important to get the right sample from the patients, bring out the best in those samples, and then we utilize what we call the hyperbaric oxygen chamber. The hyperbaric oxygen chamber that I have is a hard chamber. The chamber that has been designed and proven to have anti-aging properties. Why? Because it can activate your longevity genes. So of course, after one treatment, we don't reverse aging, but we get the best possible cells out of something that is when the individual has fasted, when they've gone into the hyperbaric chamber then we collect the blood then we spin it in such a way to get the best PRP from that sample before injecting it into the location that we think is of the greatest problem instead of having an 80% success rate our success rate has now gone up to 95% and there is no side effects there is no downtime there is no adverse effects so in fact the beauty of using PRP, unlike steroids, is that when you have a pain signal, that signal is actually telling the PRP to, uh, to go to the location to address that inflammation. So in fact, after a PRP injection, you can actually stay active and that accelerates your healing.